Hi, I'm Arsham Shabani, anterior segment and glaucoma surgeon at Washington University in St. Louis. This is a case of primary angle closure glaucoma with over 300 degrees of peripheral anterior sinecae, and we'll be demonstrating the Catina disposable single mirror. It's nicely designed with a curved undersurface uh, in which you can pass instruments through. After phaco emulsification, we will sweep myocol uh, against the iris in order to constrict the pupil. We then use 23 gauge micro grasping forceps. If you look at the right side of the, the video, you'll see that you're looking through the mirror of the uh, single mirrored gonio uh, from Katina. And as we grab peripheral iris, we gently pull centrally until we see the peripheral anterior sneakeye releasing and we can start to see trabecular meshwork. These are pretty high sneakeye. You can see two pigmented bands. One is uh, almost like a pigmented uh, Sampolese's line. The one beneath it is the trabecular meshwork. We rotate the gonio mirror and we continue to release peripheral anterior sneakeye um, as we go again, this patient had over 300 degrees of scar tissue. We're now going to be working in another quadrant. As you see, that arrow just shows where the sneak eyes still remain. Uh, just to the left of it, you can see that there's a faint band of trabecular meshwork. And as we start to pull, you'll see just uh, where the arrow is going to point an area that the sneak eye will then release. And you'll start to see a band of trabecular meshwork just there. And we continue to do that for um, the majority of the, the case. It's a very tedious process. You need good optics. And the single mirror has the nice recessed portion under which you can work through. And again, what we're showing here um, are the areas that, that are open after the syniculisis. We inject myocol back into the anterior chamber at the conclusion of the, of the case to constrict the pupil. And when we view the angle with the single mirror, Again, we're seeing the trabecular meshwork is now visible. Uh, the parts in which we had been working in are now open. And this patient actually did quite well after phaco emulsification with gonia sneculisis.